Hey guys, it's Van. Welcome back to Bumbling Panda and to the third week in our 10 dresses in 10 week summer sewing series. So take a look um, at the dress we're making today. It's a simple elastic waist curved hem dress and you're going to need a like bright print woven sort of fabric. Also say hello to Reggie. He's a three pound Maltese that I've been watching and he's going to be helping me co-host today. So let's get started. So like I said, for this project, I'm going to be using one yard of a bright print woven fabric. You can use a stretchy knit if you prefer, but stretch is not recommended or required for this project. Um, I used another dress as a guide to cut out the basic shape of the dress, and I'm going to cut out two pieces. Next, I take my two pieces, fold it in half, and even out any rough edges. To cut the curved hem, I just made the sides shorter than the front and the back. So with the two pieces folded in half, I just went ahead and cut a curve. Next, I take one piece and folded it in half, and I dropped the neckline by a few inches, which will make this my front piece. I cut out neckline facing, so to do that, I just used a different fabric. You can use the same type of fabric also, I just preferred a different type. And I cut out a strip that matches the neckline exactly, and it's going to be maybe about 2-3 to three inches wide, but the curve is um, going to match the neckline exactly. Then with the right sides facing together, I'm going to pin the facing to the neckline. I'm going to make a facing for the back piece as well, so I pretty much did the same. I just cut a strip of fabric about 2-3 to three inches wide that matches the back neckline exactly. Then I also pinned the facing to the neckline, right sides facing together. Next I sewed the facing to the neckline, and of course I do this to both the front and back pieces. Next I folded the facing over so that the wrong sides are facing, and then I'm going to top stitch that seam. While I was at it, I also hemmed the raw edges of the sleeves, and of course I do this to both the front and the back pieces. Next I placed both pieces right sides together, and then I pinned and sewed the shoulders and side seams. So next, I tried on the dress and marked exactly where it hits my waistline, which is right there. Then I take the dress, I'm going to fold it in half, but I do it in a way where the bodice is going to go inside the skirt with the right sides facing. It was a little tricky, but I evened it out as best as possible. Then I cut a piece of elastic that fits around my waist exactly. And then I'm going to fold it in half and sew the ends of the elastic, but be careful not to twist the elastic itself. Then I pinned the elastic to the waistline of the dress as evenly as possible. Next, I'm going to sew the elastic to the waistline of the dress, and I'm going to stretch the elastic as I sew. It's going to be kind of tricky, but you'll get the hang of it. Um, just remember to keep stretching the elastic. Since I already hemmed the sleeves, the only thing I need to do is finish the raw edges of the bottom and I'm going to do that with a rolled hem. So yeah, this is what it looks like and I hope you guys like it. If you make it, please send me photos and also don't forget to send me photos of the other dresses that you have made in this series. Don't forget to visit my blog for more details on this dress and also on what fabric to buy for next week's dress. So I'll see you guys on Tuesday for the next dress video. Thanks guys, bye!